Hello, this is Evangelist Dr. Robert L. McKim Sr. from Carrollton, Ohio. Yesterday, I, I well, noticed somebody made a video trying to say that I dumped grease down the sink. I said, I do not. But see, here's what you like to do. You like to take my videos, which I've told you, you do not have permission to take my videos and edit them for your own stupid, retarded purposes. But yet, you think you have the right to do that. But see, if someone was to actually go to my YouTube channel and see my actual videos, they will know that you are violating YouTube guidelines by doing what you're doing. But then, you know, seems like to me YouTube really doesn't care that your whole channel is about violating YouTube guidelines. You put pornography on your channel. You put lies after lies on your channel. You take other people's, mainly mine, videos and you edit them. For your own sick and twisted and perverted mindset. Now I'm making this video to prove I do not I do, do not, do not, do not put grease down my sink. And I'll prove to you here that I do not. I will show you. See, there's my griddle. Let me make sure here it's angled right here. There's my griddle. And then what I do is, so I have this paper towel here, so that the you know, grease from when I'm making bacon or whatever, now, that's not a lot of grease, really. That's not a lot of bacon grease when it comes right down to it. But if you say that's a lot of bacon grease, when really, you don't know. I need to take off my glasses for this because Oh, okay. Yeah, I can that's what that's for there too. Okay. Alright, let me see here. I need to turn this here if I can. There we go. Here we go. And go right down towards the sink the, where I need it there. Now, here's what I do. I have this right here. It has some mixture of oil and bacon grease already inside of it. And then I take a spatula. And I take and I put the grease into this that I don't need. As you can see, that's not a lot of bacon, that's not a lot of bacon grease.
The reason why I do it over the griddle is because so it doesn't drip anywhere else but onto the griddle. Because I'll be using this grease on the griddle as well. Because I use a little bit of this grease when I fry up the hash browns. So you got to have some oil on the griddle to fry up hash browns. You don't want to put hash browns onto something without any any uh, oil whatsoever. See, it goes right back. The lid goes on here so it doesn't get dumped anywhere. I put the uh, I put the uh, grill back over there. And then what grease is maybe around here, I wipe it up. <sighs> Dry my hands. As I've said before, or showed yesterday, in a video I made yesterday, here's a, a little bit of grease that's on the plate here from what, you know, soaked through the paper towel. That's all that goes into my sink. cheese which is basically shredded potatoes no they're not browned up already why should I buy something that has has already been actually pre-cooked and it has flour to hold it together so I put a handful basically maybe a little bit more because my hands not that big of the hash browns on the griddle Okay, now, as you can see, hash browns is on the griddle. Now here comes some bacon. I don't have bacon every single, you know, time for breakfast. I just, I buy this kind of bacon. That is called slab bacon. Slab bacon. bacon. Bacon that's been cut off the slab of bacon. Bacon that has not been treated with a lot of salt and other uh, chemicals. They treat it by rubbing the whole slab of bacon with salt and then hanging it in a uh, smokehouse. So here's uh, four slices right here. 
two for me and two for Renee, because that leaves two more left. I could actually fry these up today, and that way it has sausage starting tomorrow. So there'll be three slices for me and three slices for Renee today. And of course, Queenie thinks she should get some now. My dad spoiled her when she was younger by giving her ham, like chip chopped ham. Because my mother used to get a lot of chip chopped ham. And they would always feed her chip chopped ham. Now the uh, food will cook on the grill. And I don't add no more grease to it because uh, bacon makes its own grease. After it cooks up for a while like that, and I flip and then I move things around, I take the hash browns, move it down here where all the grease is right now, then I move the bacon back over onto this side of the griddle. That's how I do things. Let me raise this up a little bit so hopefully won't die. That's how I do things. If you don't like it, I don't care. Don't come to my channel if you don't want to hear and learn the truth. Because all you're doing, like I've said, is coming to my channel and, and taking my videos and editing them to make it sound like I'm saying and doing something that I'm clearly not doing. But again, that goes to show what kind of people you really are. You're full of hatred. You're full of... Uh, Deceit and your form of evil. And I'll be adding this to a video. Another video I'll be making here soon. But God bless you. Have a blessed day.